Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, we'll be continuing the kettlebell training that we've been doing. Today, we have a great back workout for you using one kettlebell. Keep watching. So we are going to move into the routine that we like to do our five favorite workout, back workout exercises to do with this kettlebell. If you hear some noise in the background, please excuse it. We have our heater going on here because it's cold and we like to get a good sweat going on um, as our, we're working out. So let's move into the first workout that we're gonna do. It's a, a deadlift using the kettlebell. Um, your stance is gonna be, your feet are gonna be shoulder width apart and the kettlebell is gonna be right in the center of you. Deadlifts are a great back workout in general. What you wanna do from this position, you wanna bring your butt down, keep your chest up. Sometimes you find uh, that you, your position kind of misaligns and you, you find yourself doing this. You wanna keep your butt down and your chest up. And at the top, you're going to squeeze your glutes. So here, it'll look like All right, the second workout that we're gonna be doing are rows. For this one, your feet are gonna be a little bit wider apart. Again, you wanna keep the kettlebell in the center. The reason is that you wanna focus more on your lower lats here. And what you're gonna do is when you're coming up with the kettlebell, you're gonna bring it towards the lower right here, kind of like your thigh area right there. Again, that's gonna really focus on your lower lats. So, there and try to keep your back at a 90 degree angle as you're doing these The third movement we're gonna be doing is somewhat of a combination of the first two. We have our kettlebell here in a different position. You'll see that it's laying on the floor like that because we're gonna be holding it differently. So the first thing that you'll do is bring the kettlebell toward the center of your body, of your upper body, and then drive it up and do a hinge movement at the top. So together, it'll look like this, bring it, and then stand. Again, keep it toward the center of your body as you bring it toward you. it more at the center instead of more toward the lower part of your body like the second workout this is going to focus more on the upper upper part of your lats and that's what we want to do with this movement fourth workout that we're going to be doing are kettlebell swings and this again is going to kind of target your entire back this is an overhead swing that we're going to be doing so you've seen a regular kettlebell swing probably where you bring it up like this about halfway here we're gonna be swinging it, swinging it over our heads. Again, it'll really get the muscles in your back. So feet about shoulder width apart or a little bit further. And you're gonna start with the kettlebell in the center again and drive it all the way up over your head.
All right, so for the final workout that we're gonna be doing, this is more of a posture correction uh, movement, but it's also a great burnout workout to do. So we're not gonna be using the kettlebell in this one, but here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna align your back to a wall and to correct posture, still working out your back, uh, you're gonna have your arms against the wall in a sort of T-like position and drive them up. And you wanna keep your arms aligned to the wall as much as possible. Just keep them against the wall. Keep it nice and slow, but again, it, it is a burnout, so you're doing as much as you can. All right, guys, there you have it. Our full back workout routine using the kettlebell. We got a good sweat uh, and we didn't even complete our usual three to four rounds, which we would recommend to you. Uh, three to four rounds for eight, eight to 15 reps, um, if you can knock that out. Guarantee it's a good workout. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button. If you're new here, please consider subscribing so we can continue to grow our channel. The full back workout routine that we just did will be in the description below, along with the links to our social media. So please follow us. If you have any comments, leave them in the comment section below. And until next time, guys, peace.